Good afternoon, everybody. Okay, so it's like almost 2 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm not doing this to start late on purpose. Um, ooh. Oh, no, my lip. I think I cut my lip. So I got like a nice little gash right there, and it hurts so bad. And also, um, I ate pudding, so there's probably pudding on my mouth. Yay! But no, um, I'm not starting this late on purpose. I had to go into work this morning because I have a job. And they needed me this morning, and then, like, I talked to them because I had a dentist appointment. So I went and did my dentist appointment, and my mouth is killing me right now. So I can't really, like, talk right now, so I'm probably sounding very little right now. No, so I'm sorry about that. But it was just a crazy day today, and um, you're probably wondering, well, why the hell do you care? It's not like you're, like... A regular vlogger. Well, that's the thing. Um, I just found out that Vlogmas started on um, the 1st. It is now the 2nd of December. So I'm a little behind. Um, but that's okay. Um, better late than never, I guess. Uh, so, not much to tell. Uh, my main thing to say is I am I'm not running this camera well. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, no, I'm just pacing around my house right now because... I don't like sitting still for a long period of time unless I'm like trying to get a point across. But right now I'm just kind of like walking around. It's probably very dark in here. The lighting in my house is horrible. Like I live in an old trailer. Like this, this my home used to be a trailer. And so like it's a trailer from like the 1980s or something. So the lighting in here is atrocious. But yet if I opened up a blind or something... It would put, like, way too much light in here, and then it gets really hot in here, and then it's just, nobody's winning. Plus, I'm also in, like, 52 layers right now because it's cold out. It's just getting colder out. I mean, it's not that bad out, but it's still pretty damn cold. But anyway, the main thing I want to say is, um, I am going to try to do Vlogmas. I highly doubt I'll be able to because I'm pretty sure, um, I'm not interesting enough to vlog about anything. And, um, on days that I have to work... The vlogs will be a lot, a lot, lot, lot shorter. Oh, I found a mirror. I can yeah, make sure you all are not up in my face. But no, um, they'll probably be a lot shorter when I'm uh, when I'm working, because you know, girl gotta make a living. Girl gotta make a life. It happens, you know, normal people in the world. We work. <sighs> I hate working. Uh, no, I don't mind working with the uh, daycare kids. But no, um. If you're wondering where we're at, we're in my living room, and there's a TV, but I don't ever watch TV anymore anyway, the only time I watch TV now is to watch The Walking Dead, so, yeah, um, yeah, but I'm gonna try to do Vlogmas, no idea if it's gonna work or not, uh, yeah, I'm just letting you all know that, um, uh, we'll see what happens. Does anybody still watch Jenna Marbles? I fucking love this woman, she makes me laugh so hard no matter what she's doing she just has this great personality that like makes me want to just like laugh she makes me smile she just I don't know I've been watching her forever and like I'm so excited when I see and I'm so glad she's doing vlogmas too actually she's the reason I found out what it was her and rim life and I was like oh that, looks, that sounds fun I want to do that but um I'm so glad she's doing these because she just she just makes me happy, and to see a video from her every day for this December is going to be awesome. Especially since this December, I'm going to be, like, stressing the fuck out about so many things. I got Christmas to worry about, I got New Year's to worry about, and then I got my move happening, like, right after, and it's just <sighs> so much to think about. So, I'm, I don't know, like, I'm so happy that so many YouTubers are doing Vlogmas, and I'm also so happy that there are YouTubers out there that post every day that I love, because they just... That, that shit's hard. Like, it's hard to want to vlog and, like, do something every day. But, like, I don't know. That I'm glad they do it because they make me happy. And, like, now I just wonder, like, do any of you watch Jenna? Because she, she's fucking great. I, uh, she makes me smile. I just had to share that. I just, I'm, I'm feeling like I'm having a good day today. It's been, it's been crazy. And children have been screaming at me all day. But it's been a good day nonetheless. So I'm just, I'm, I'm good. And I'm glad I was able to wake up on time. Because if y'all know me, I could sleep till fucking like 4 o'clock in the afternoon and have no fucks. Besides hating the fact that I slept till 4. <laughs> but uh, yeah. 
Wee. Uh, I make weird noises. So I need to stop. <laughs> I've got Captain America on my boobies. Cause I love Captain America. And I don't care if it's supposed to be four guys. They can suck it. Cause I like Captain America in my hair though. Check it out. We're in the bathroom right now. You know, because lighting. Also because I'm about to take a bath. Because, um... I, I just, look, look at me, I'm, woo, I'm rough looking, plus, I still smell like daycare, Ugh, and I hate smelling like daycare, I don't, I don't understand, if you, does this happen to anybody else that works in a daycare, because, I will fucking come out smelling like babies, and like, I don't even know what these smells are, like chemicals, and babies, and, it's not cool, I don't like it, I'm gonna go take a bath, and you know, I got a question for you all, did any of you all, was there ever a time in your life where your parents were like, you're a big, you're a big kid now, you don't need to take baths, you need to start taking showers? Because, like, when I was younger, and I hit about 13, 14, and all that yearly shit started happening to me, you know, all that fun stuff of Mother Nature being a fucking cunt, oops, I didn't say that. When all that girly stuff happened, my mom came to me and was like, okay, honey, um... You're a big girl now. You're going to have to start taking a shower now. And I'm like, okay. And she's like, well, that means you don't need to be taking baths that much because it's really not healthy for you, especially when it's that time of the month. And I was just like, well, why? Why can't I take a bath? And then there was this whole debate. We got, we got into a huge fight over it. I'm going to sit down. Let's on toilet. Let me, let me have a toilet talk with you. No, um, so my mom, she was like, well, it's just not healthy for you. And then we got into this whole fight. Like, I can remember, like, because I used to fight with my mom a lot. You know, 13, 14 years old, you're just like, man, fuck everything, basically. And I got into this huge fight with her over it. And I was just like, no, because, like, I was so not comfortable with the idea of taking a shower all the time. I don't know why. I don't even remember why. I just was like... I don't want to, like, and then, like, it, it just sparked this huge fight between us, and, like, the main thing I remember is that neither of us were happy with it because it got to the point where, like, my mom had to come into the bathroom to make sure I was taking a shower because she'd be like, you need to stop taking baths, <laughs> and it, it was just the stupidest fucking thing, and I don't even remember why we got into this whole big fight over it, but we did. Anyway, I started developing this thing where, like, well... I don't want to take baths, I mean I want to take baths, but I don't want to take showers, but my mom wants me to take showers, she doesn't want me to take baths. So I started doing this thing that I was calling, um, um, bat, what did I call it? It was like, shaft. Yeah, it was shaft, which is basically a shower and a bath. So I'd, ha I'd let the bath water run, and like, I'd get it to like, to where it at least covered my feet. And then I'd turn on the shower and I'd close the curtain. So it would sound like I was taking a shower, but I'd be sitting in the bathtub taking a bath. And so, like, did any of you all ever do that? Because, like, I seriously, seriously did not like taking showers when I was younger. So I was like, well, fine. <laughs> so I used to, so I did that. And then finally, as I got older, obviously, I started taking more showers. But I still take baths because... They, they're relaxing. They're, they're really relaxing for you. But did, did you all ever do that? Did you ever, like, turn on the sh like turn on your bathtub and just, like, get up in the bathtub, but you also had the shower thing running? And then, like, I remember, like, one time I was being stupid. And I was like, I'm going to put an umbrella in here. So I stuck an umbrella in here. And I was like, there, that way I can take my bath without getting rained on. And then I made a huge mess everywhere, and I got in so much trouble. But I don't know. I just had to share that story. Did any of you all ever do anything like that? God, I was a bad child. <laughs> Currently very upset. I can't find my library card. And I wanted to go check out some books on um, some finance stuff that I wanted to research. And I couldn't find my library card anywhere. And it's really making me sad. And I'm not going to buy a new one because I'm going to be moving soon. And my car is beeping at me. Shut up! But anyway, I'm going to be... I'm going to be moving since there's really no point for me to get a new one. But it's very frustrating and I'm just... <sighs> I want my card! So I really don't want to go to work at all. But I gotta. Because money and life and... Yeah. <sighs> Seriously, I'm really irritated I have to work tonight. Like, I know 
I was prepared for it, but now I'm just irritated, and I'm so, I'm tired, like, I, I don't know why I'm so tired, again, again, this is my life, I'm always fucking tired, and I don't know why, and it really irritates me, like, I go to bed early, I get up, like, at a decent time, which is usually at, like, 6 or 7, or I try to, and then, like, I'm still tired, but yet, if I sleep, like, from, like, I don't know, midnight to, like, three o'clock, I'm still fucking tired, it never fails, I am always tired, and, like, everybody says, like, well, it's probably your diet and all that stuff, how, I changed my diet, I fixed it, I've been eating healthier, I've been taking care of myself, I mean, I had, like, a bad pizza choice the other night, but otherwise, I've been doing real good at taking care of myself, and yet, lo and behold, I'm always fucking tired, and I don't want to be tired anymore, I don't like it. I should not be this tired. I'm only 25 years old. I should not be this tired all the time. But yet here I am. I'm tired all the time. And my eyes are just watering. And it's just... I got sleep in my eye. I don't know what to do. This happened to you all? Because I feel like... I'm like cursed right now. I feel like I'm cursed. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to make it better. Help me! <laughs> I don't want to be tired anymore. scared the shit out of me. I thought I completely cracked the viewing screen, but I didn't. But um, I was fucking around with it a while ago and trying to make sure everything was still working. So everything's good, but still it scared the shit out of me. Uh, still at work. Yay. Um, I have to be here till eight o'clock, but I generally get out kind of a little earlier than that. But it's a, it's a pretty simple job. I mean, once you get the hang of it, you're you're good to go. It's really, everybody, a lot of people complain about the building I work, but it's really like, it's actually one of the easiest buildings I think there is, just because of the fact that like, I know it so well, and like, I know what I'm doing, and like, also the fact that um, if you keep up with your work, life can go pretty easy. Like, as long as you do your best to keep up with what you can keep up with, you'll get through life pretty damn good. Yeah. So, you know, they're doing this thing called Living Window outside, and it's kind of funny to look out the window of the work and just see all these people just walking across the road. They have fake snow outside. Like, it's not fake. I don't, I don't know if it's fake. Well, it might be fake snow. I don't know. But they, they put snow on the sidewalk out there, and I'm like, why are you putting that shit out there? We don't want it yet. I don't even care if it's supposed to be festive. Just get it the fuck away. But it's so, fu it's so funny, but it's also really cute to see the kids go run over and play in it, so... That's pretty fun, and it's also just like, I want to be where the people are. I want to get out of here. <laughs> but nope, I'm stuck in here for another, I don't even know what time it is. What time is it? Yeah, I'm stuck in here for another 30 or so minutes, so. Uh, uh, uh. So bored. Also, I'm very hungry. Like, uh. But I know I'm not going to be able to get anything at home really good because my mom has to work tonight. And my dad is, um, not the best chef. So I'm going to have to fend for myself. And it looks like it's probably going to be frozen burritos or something. Awesome. Hey, Billy, look up. No. <laughs> Already got you on video. <laughs> yeah, it No. He's so cute. He's so camera shy. <laughs> Billy! <laughs> Come on. Yeah, turn around. Yes. Oh, fine, big poo, poo head. Ha! So the most amazing thing just happened at Hy-Vee. So I, I went into Hy-Vee to get some frozen pizzas because I love frozen pizzas. And um, we were waiting in line and one of the cashiers like right behind me, she looked over at one of her companions, one of the people she worked with, and she goes, you look so lonely down there. And he was like, yeah, or whatever. Ooh. And so I was like, under my breath, 
I, I can't help this. When I hear something that reminds me of a song, I will start to, I will start to sing it. And so as soon as she said that, it automatically made me think of that song. One is the loneliest number. And then I sung that under my breath. And nobody said anything. And so I'm like, oh, nobody else got that. Well, then all of a sudden, the girl next to me uh, started singing, two can be as bad as one. And that just made my night. I love when people are like that. I love when they join in on goofy antics without any questions asked. They're just like, yep, I'm going to join that. And that just... To me, that, that makes me happy. That makes me smile because sometimes you just gotta be goofy. And like, I am a goofy person. I am an awkward goober goofy. Goober goober. Gooby gooby goober. And I will always be a gooby gooby goober. And so stuff like that just really cheers me up. But I had to share that because it, it was a cute moment and it, it really made my heart swell with joy. <sighs> yo, 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 I'm home now. I don't know why I yo yo yoed. That, don't don't let me do that again. If I do that again, somebody slap me. I no. Anyway, I'm home now. Um, yeah. Uh, get to make some pizza. Pizza. Mmm. It's so frozen right now. Woo. Frozen, frozen. It is. Yuck. Yep. Just about to wait for this oven to preheat to 450, and then gonna get me some pizza eat some pizza, and then, uh, I guess edit this, what I have on this camera right now. So I guess this is basically the end of the vlog. Um, I'm sorry, again, not that interesting, but that's about my day. That's just, my days aren't that interesting yet. Hopefully one day they will be. Hopefully I'll have a story to tell. But for now, it's just this random girl running around trying to survive life and not, you know, trip and fall on her face. Even though it might improve this. But anyway, nothing else to talk about. Uh, thanks for putting up with me. I will see you next time.